a gay puppy here. Let's talk about firearms. Starting off with the biggest category on talking about firearms, the Second Amendment to the Constitution of the United States. It talks about the militia being supplied, the right of the people to keep and bear arms and not be infringed. They weren't talking about the police. They weren't talking about the army. They were talking about the armed citizenry. Because they'd just gone through an insane king. Yeah, George III was later, or by then, I forget which, confined to the Tower of London for the rest of his life. King was screaming freaking nuts. Danger to himself and others. So, yes, your majesty, now come along. Have your porridge. Uh, I imagine they had big, beefy soldiers to care for his majesty because he was violent. His government officials, corrupt, thieves, murderers, perverts, the legislature, ah, ah, ah. America just come out from underneath that. They said, we ain't going to have no more crazy rulers, impotent legislatures, and corrupt courts. Keeping poor people getting robbed, raped, and murdered by the rich and powerful. Yeah. They intended the armed citizenry to be the last defense of the Constitution from crazy criminal president impotent Congress and corrupt court. The people who want the crazy criminal president out they say, get rid of the guys! Uh-huh. And do you wonder why I say all politicians are retards? 